Hey guys, this is Too Much Class, and today, with Alex, we are together... The, the pair. pair! Perfect. And today we were discussing really what we're going to do for this channel and how we're going to go about it. So we've come up to the conclusion that, like, once a week for the next... However long this goes on, weeks, years ahead, uh, we're going to be doing virtual vlogs like this. To update you on what's going on, new videos or an idea we might have. And as you probably noticed, this week, this video is about music. So, the question is, what type of music do you like and why do you like it? I'll start with Alex and then we can throw it back and forth, have a bit of discussion, and then we'll leave it up to you in the comments below. How's about that? Sounds great. Cool. Take it away. Well, I like lots of different kinds of music, including classical, like the kind you get on this. Now this has various different kinds of classical music by different composers. One of which is Debussy, who I think is a great classical composer. If you haven't listened to, I think it's called Le Mer, I think, you should. It's absolutely brilliant. It's wonderful. Best piece. Best pieces of classical music ever. I noticed, check them out. I noticed that was a CD. Do you like streaming music? I like both. Hmm. They, they, they're all good, you see, because CDs, they can be played in the car, they can be played on the on your sound system and then I mean you can do the same with a you know a phone but of course sometimes if you're using iTunes or Apple Music it's only you'll have to use your 4G where CDs don't have that problem well you see I kind of uh, got rid of all my CDs back at like 2011 2012 area not got rid of them per se, but I got I didn't really practically have any use for them. I've been streaming music now on Spotify geez, going on since 2012, 2011, guys. Serious. And I really listen to all sorts, considered from jazz to country music to and then this will shock you all to heavy metal. I mean, it's been a while since I did that. Just saying. But <laughs> the point is, I listen to mostly jazz and country. That's just me. And when I say country music, you don't know what I'm on about. I'm on about the music from America with the cowboy hats. And yeah, you get the idea. That type of music. It's cool. They talk, they speak more about life, in my opinion. But I also like instrumentals from soundtracks. You know, like movie scores oh, or, yeah. or even game soundtracks. I mean, some of the game soundtracks, I mean, they're pretty impressive by themselves. I mean, I remember there was something, and you can look it up on YouTube. Someone's uploaded it. Uh, the game called Ape Escape, okay? Look up the time, I think, time machine or time something music. Oh, someone put a 30 hour place of that. That's good stuff. Good on you, bro. So, what do you think? I mean, personally, for me, streaming is the way forward. I can't, I've got one CD, I think, left in my house of mine. The rest I give to my mum because she always wanted to keep them because she didn't want me to get rid of them. Well,. I like both, because I still do quite a lot of streaming as well, but I'm in the car, so. I mean, that plays into the also, also, which is better also, Spotify or Apple Music? Because they're both streaming systems, aren't they? Well, I use iTunes. True, but iTunes is where you buy the music, isn't it? Yeah, I like it that way. So would you rather, like, say, buy the downloaded content, or would you rather buy the CD version? Because remember, if you do buy the downloadable one, you're putting these guys out of business, the CD people. It's kind of like DVDs, if you will. Uh, uh, if you're buying it from uh, iTunes and you're buying it from the movies, instead of going to, like, say, HMV or such like, instead of like that, what would you rather? Tough one. For me, I would rather buy it because I'm just lazy to everyone. I'd rather just get it there and then. That's just who I am. I mean, I do it with my games, Xbox, I just download from the Xbox store. I don't go to the you know, store anymore and buy the disc. Very rare. And even then, there's Amazon, but you get my point. Hmm. That's another competitor, actually, by the way, on that topic. There's Amazon Music, the, uh, Amazon Prime Music, correct me if I'm wrong, guys. And then there's Spotify, and then there's Apple Music. And I think there's something in America called Pandora. I could be wrong. But what do you think? <sighs> Whatever works. I'm very picky, I guess. That's just not here. Okay. Do you have anything else, sir? Well, all I'll say is, um, please tell us what music you like and what recording media you like to listen to in the comments below. We look yeah. forward to reading them. 
And also, one more question I want to add, and I think this will be interesting. How do you listen to music? Do you listen to earphones, small ones, or do you listen through headphones? That's Dr. Dre. Yeah. I do like his beats. I honestly do like his beats. I'm personally a big fan, and it's just me. Is Dr. Dre an actual doctor? Yes, he is. Dr. Uh, no way. I could be wrong. Google me, someone in the comments. <laughs> but I'm pretty what sure is there his is. PhD in? What is his doctorate? Study? <laughs> yeah. What's his PhD in? Where did he study? But yeah. So yeah, there's that. Anything there? Wow. I look forward to reading the comments. Yeah, me too. So, what's your favorite music? What type of music do you listen to? And more, and where do you listen to it? CD or also a streaming service or and also one last thing how you listen to it that's an interesting little video right there anyways thank you for watching us all yeah yeah and we'll see you all in the next video bye everyone bye